What's up, family? Welcome to our first Supreme Week series pickup video. Let's go. We got week one Supreme. I know this video is pretty late, but uh, living in Colorado, I guess it just takes Supreme 15 days it takes, to get our stuff yeah, in. Yeah, it so. took a while, actually. But week one always does take the longest, so yeah. hopefully it won't be like that all year. But we got a ton of stuff we want to show you guys. Put a sucker in my pocket. You want it? No. You want it? No. Okay. So Take we're gonna be go showing you guys what we picked up today, showing you some shots, some close-ups, so the the drip we got. We'll warn you guys, not really warning, but all this stuff isn't ours. We're gonna be selling a lot of it. Mm -hmm. uh, we're spending some bread, so we need to make a lot of it back. So just you know the, way the grind. It rolls. You know the grind. But uh, yeah. So I'm gonna show off all my stuff first, mm -hmm. and then he'll go. Yeah, let's get right into it. Where it's <laughs> really after, right into it after this. So we got. A giveaway for you guys and it's pretty dope all right we're gonna be giving away these little shoe keychains we got a bunch of different 350s we got some jordans yep. this little little sneak bag. peek i don't want to show you guys what we got because it's a mystery so there's there's a ton of them so and you're also going to get a free sticker yes Hold sir up. there it is free Ooh. sticker free free keychain and for free free Free, 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 free. You guys oh, have seen. You guys have seen the ad. Yeah. If you guys want a keychain and a sticker, and you know maybe we'll throw in something else for the lucky dogs. Ooh. You just got to do what's on screen, and you'll get yourself all those things for free. Uh, you just got to get in contact with us on Instagram and hit us up with your addy. Easy peasy, one and done. Subscribe <laughs> if you're not already subscribed. <laughs> like the video, and let's get into this shit, boy. Do first. it. Let's do it. Alrighty, so let's get into some shirts first. Alrighty, first up, the paint logo, T in the color white, and it is a large. So, pretty dope. Uh, I think this is one of the kind of a little bit more hype tees, but you know, I don't know if I'm gonna keep it. I mean, when Supreme comes in, you just wanna keep it, all of it. Even if it's shitty and for some reason you don't know why you bought it, you wanna keep it. But to make some profit back, I'll probably be selling this thing. Next up, we got the Sacred Unique T in the gray colorway. It is a size large as well. All right, so this one, uh, it's dope, it's a dope piece. Uh, it's kind of kind of a creepy shirt, not gonna lie. It says Sacred Unique Psycho Electro Murder Everyone. So yeah, if you haven't seen it, here it is. But next up, we got the black reserved logo beanie. Um, I gotta say, I got the over dyed beanie from Fall Winter 18. Yeah, Fall Winter 18. Um, and I was not impressed with the size and like the fit of that one So I decided to go with a different kind of material for this one And I gotta say that it turned out a lot better than the other one and I like how it's the foldable one So this one keeping for sure like how it fits. It's actually really comfortable too. So keeping and then real quick I got some undies. You know what's going on? I got black ones from last season so you just gotta add some different colors to the collection, you know what I'm saying? Alrighty, let's get into the accessories. You already know how to cop a shoulder bag. This is the blue camo. Not sure the name, but it's a little smaller than I expected. I opened the package and I was like, what is this tiny thing? But I've already sported it and I like it. This is my first shoulder bag actually. I'm really liking how it fits. So this, it's a personal. Keeping for sure. Got to add a shoulder bag to the collection. All right. Next up, we got the Audubon Bird Call. This thing majorly, majorly smaller than I thought it was gonna be. Cause I've never seen a bird call like this. But I don't know how to use it. But it is pretty annoying. It, it's super fucking annoying. I'll never actually use it probably for anything, but to be annoying. One of those just stupid accessories that. You just buy just because it has Supreme on it. Yep, and it was pretty, pretty cheap. All right guys, so that was Clayton's collection. Since he ended with skate decks, I'm gonna show my skate decks first. So first one, the Tupac deck. Now on camera, it looks pretty good, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna say right now, in person, it really looks kind of like blurry and just not that good. I was surprised when I saw it, how like blurry and just bad it looked in person. But uh, I guess the skate decks aren't really expensive. They're 50 bucks each. So 
I'm not, I guess I shouldn't really be expecting much. I'm still gonna make bread off this anyway. This is not a personal. I'm definitely gonna be selling this. Definitely one of the cooler decks though. All right, so deck number two, Clayton has this one, so I'm not gonna talk about it too much. The Cherries deck. Um, this one actually looks a lot better in person than the Tupac deck does, so I don't know what's up with that. But you guys saw the Supreme ring she's got on, whatever. Pretty cool looking. Pretty uh, sexual looking deck in my opinion. But uh, it's pretty cool though. I think the decks week one were all pretty fire. So if you cop the deck, you probably couldn't have even gone wrong with anything that you grabbed. So, and if you guys cop the deck and you don't want to keep it for the personal, I would definitely hold on to it for a couple months for like a year for really good profit. And all these decks I think are going to do amazing. So if you guys cop the deck, uh, yeah, hold on to that because it's going to go up for sure. All right. And my third and final deck is the Beling deck. It's pretty cool. I like this one. It's a lot better than the Bling hoodie, as you guys may have saw from our top 10 worst of the lookbook video. And it's just a bunch of money, a bunch of money in this picture. And if you copped it, hold on to it because it's going to go for some bread for the, in the future. But definitely fire. I would mind, not mind keeping this for the personal, but I don't think I'm going to be keeping any of the decks for the personal. So those are all my decks I got. Actually, I did get one more deck. It's the black distorted logo deck. So here's a quick clip of me surprising Murphy with it because he paid me to buy it for him on week one. So check it out. I got you, hey. boy. What? It said it didn't come in, boy. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, dude. I was looking at Clay's today and I was like, yeah. dude, I was freaking the fuck out, dude. <laughs> Yeah, dude. I was like, I'm just gonna tell him no. Oh yeah. Later. Oh yeah, dude. Let's go. I appreciate that. The surprise made it even much better. Yeah, yeah, Fuck I thought yeah. so. Okay, next thing I'll get into is the utility pouch. You know, I think this is like 30 bucks or something, and it's definitely not worth more than 30 bucks. It's really just plain, not that amazing. But uh, if you guys copped one of these, specifically the black and red colorway. I would definitely hold on to that because I think it's gonna go up in the future. Yeah, but if you like it too, I mean, it's it wasn't that expensive, so you can always just keep it if you want as well. All right, so I, I did only cop two bags. This is the shoulder bag. Uh, Clayton got the same exact one because he's a poser. F that guy. Leave a like if you hate Clayton. Um, you know, Cordura, durable, versatile, reliable. That's what you get with Cordura, okay? We both cop the blue colorway because the blue colorway is the best in pretty much everyone's opinion. It sold out week one, which is pretty surprising because that doesn't really happen very often. So I think people definitely thought this was fire. Uh, Clayton did say it's a lot smaller in, in person. As you guys can see, I can palm that So yeah, it's pretty small. And I'm a shoulder bag guy, so I had to cop one for sure, especially with the low retail. All right, guys, and some accessories after the bags. I also ended up copying the Aduban bird call. Look at that focus. Damn. Yup. That's the best I've ever seen this camera focus. That was some bad shit right there. You know, it's definitely very kind of useless for everyone that bought it, but with such a low retail that I had, I think it really wasn't, you know, that bad of a cop. So if you copped, that's cool. My window is always open in the morning, so I might bust this bitch out in the morning and just call some birds over to my window, see if it works, so. Pretty cool though, and cheap, so I had to cop it. Next thing I got is the Nalgene water bottle. Pretty cool. Uh, I like how it came with the sleeve. Kind of switched things up a little bit. You can take the sleeve off and then it has a little red box logo on, under the sleeve, so that's pretty cool. But you know, Supreme does their water bottle things every now and then, every season, it seems like. I can promise you that if you wear this Nalgene with this cover on it and drop it anywhere, you're gonna be fine. This thing's not gonna break. A cover and an Nalgene, this is like, the Nokia of water bottles. Okay, so you're not gonna break it. Definitely pretty cool. I'm also gonna hold on to this for a while and sell it because I think this is gonna make some bread. So if you guys got one, hold on to it. All right, next thing I got is the glow in the dark Zippo. Supreme does her things with Zippos too. Uh, I would say if you cop this for resale, hold on to it for a while. It'll go up, it'll make some bread in the future. So if you're selling it, uh, definitely hold on. Don't sell it yet and uh, make some bread. But let's turn off the lights. See what this looks like. So yeah, I mean, it's glowing. I didn't even have it in the light very long. Yeah, not bad. But yeah, not not for a personal use. I don't really have a use for a Zippo, but yeah, I just bought it for the resale. Next up, nothing crazy. Got a three pack of some size large Hanes. And let me just say, 
Hanes shirts aren't usually this comfortable, so I'm already pleasantly surprised with that. But you know, the bottom of the shirt has the little box logo. That's pretty much it. You know, I didn't really get it just for the box logo. I just kind of wanted some, some black tees that I can keep nice. I have some black tees at home, but they're just kind of dirtied up. So definitely I'm gonna use these for like nice outfits and stuff, not at work. So overall, a pretty good cop. And on the topic of Hanes, we also got Hanes Supreme Underwear black i think this came in a four pack so four packs of supreme underwear you know just gotta be dripping at all times and these already feel better than uh this is really weird these feel better than the ones i have home i have the red ones the ones clayton just got this season and for some reason these feel better so i don't know i'm pretty hyped about that all right next up this tee is pretty fire actually came in its own bag i think the more expensive shirts come in their own bags uh ziploc type bags this is the nothing else like it in the world supreme tee in the purple and as you guys can see right here it's like a man i don't even know what you call that but supreme there really is nothing else like it in the world you know there's no re there's really no other brand that does what supreme does so you got to give them that i also copped this for resale i don't think it's been going any for anything anytime soon so definitely gonna hold on to this i got size xl but pretty fire I would like to keep it for personal, but it's just a little too expensive. Okay, next shirt is the Naomi tee. I got the size large. This is actually for personal, so real quick. Pretty cool, but a little uh, fact I learned about these uh, tees releasing, I noticed that the Tupac tee and this tee were a little bit more expensive, and that's because they have to pay royalties to either, you know, whoever owns, whoever takes in all their money. It's either her, you know, I don't know much about her. I don't know if she's dead or alive. Uh, I probably should have done my research, but I'm a f***ing idiot. But uh, the money that Tupac made, I don't know who that goes to. But the skate deck and his t-shirt were also a little bit more expensive. And it's because of royalties for using their face, basically. So, a uh, little fact for you guys if you didn't know that. I didn't know that till week one, so. All right, next tee I got. Size XL. Uh, also, I'm sure a lot of you guys already know this, but if you're trying to resale shirts, Definitely go for size smaller XL and colors black or white. Maybe ash gray for third option. This is the master masterpieces T, and this is definitely the least hyped shirt of the uh, week for week one. But I still copped it anyway because I think in the future it might go up a little bit. Maybe not. You know, I think it's a pretty cool shirt. It's just not that appealing to other people, I guess. But I like it. But I'm not keeping it for myself. It's size XL anyway, so I can't even wear it. All right, next shirt is the Cherries tee, and I think this is navy. It looks a little black, but I'm pretty sure it's navy. Um, you know, you guys saw it on the skate deck. This is just the uh, t-shirt version of it. I guess this was an old design from back in the day, so I'm glad to see it coming out. I definitely think it's a tight tee. Definitely a little sexual, so, you know, if you guys are young, parents might not like this, but, you know, do your thing, I guess. But yeah, I got size XL, not for myself, gonna be selling it. It'll probably go up in the future. I'd say if you have white or black, size smaller XL, hold on to that for sure for resale. All right guys, this is taking forever, but I got two items left. This is the bling tee. A little bit different than the skate deck because on the t-shirt, you got a pair of panties on there. Once again, if you're a kid, you probably shouldn't wear this around your parents, you know? Uh, it's literally cash and panties. Not the best combo for your parents to see, but like I said, if you're a crazy mother then then do it, whatever. But uh, definitely fire, I like it. All right guys, the last tee finally, I think. This is called the Loved by the Children tee. And I think you got Jesus on the cross there. You know, I'm not sure what Supreme's intentions are with using the cross because they also do a lot of, or they have done like 666 stuff in the past. So, you know, I'm not sure what they're doing, but uh, I find it a little sketchy wearing this, to be honest with you, even though it's my man, you know. I got the Ash Gray colorway, size XL, also gonna be selling it in the future, but uh, pretty cool tee, I like it. Cool design, and at least it's not like a 666 tee or something, so I don't fuck with that shit. All right guys, last up, we went through everything we bought, so now we got all the free gifts. These are actually all Clayton's. He ordered all of his stuff in separate orders, so I didn't get as many stickers, but 
I know I didn't have to bring mine over because I knew he had every sticker. But as you guys are seeing, these are pretty fire stickers. I don't see really one bad sticker in this collection. And those box logo bleeding stickers are definitely some flame. So as you guys know, Clayton had to go somewhere. He's a little busy right now. So once again, thank you guys for watching. If you do want one of these keychains, if you do want one of these keychains, it's not only the, the bread 350s. We have all sorts of different ones. We got Jordans, different 350s, I think a couple other ones, and a free sticker. Then go ahead and do what's on screen. We appreciate it, guys. Thank you for your support. And uh, I think you'll be seeing weekly pickups from Supreme coming. So make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video if you like our stuff. Go check out some of our other videos. We got some fire. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Peace.